we're gonna head now to White River Beach. Let's see what them have. Oh, so the can. right there but they can stock oh cane juice you sell other things other than cane juice you sell other things other than cane juice Coconut water and cane. Okay. Oh. All right. I'll come back when I'm coming back. How long are you here? Oh, you're done. All right. Well, I'll try. When do you When are you back? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. I'll try tomorrow. Thank you. And this is what you use to press the cane. Yes. This extractor. Brilliant. Thank you. But look at this. If you look at this dear like shack, but look at that painting. And then there's some kind of going down the road there's up. Down the hill there's up. Come up. Just so soup. Four hundred dollar. Quick grab cook job. I've never seen nobody here yet. Heading to the White River Beach. Anne, which is one of my home parishes. So this little thing that you take to go down the hill. And I think there's some homes that are down there, right by the water. Let me forget. And then you see St. Mary now going that way, which is where I'm coming from. So that was St. Anne. No, I mean, that, was, that the one of the I was saying going to St. Anne, it's not, well, you know what I mean. Yeah, down here. Oh, so it's a little access point too. that you saw from the other side. Scamarem Dea. many many times
lot of work because he's pushing against the current. You saw my other video, the guy talked about what they have to do to get across. So when they do that kind of crisscrossing, what they're actually doing is um, balancing against the current. Because if they just go straight, straight, it's harder. So they just go side to side. Right? They're trying to go where they call it dead water. So they go to the sides. Because the sides where the water is more dead. white sand all the way through and all the brown stuff is actually seaweed it's not silt or anything or mud it's seaweed so it's quite impressive ah, people them down there. all right so we are gonna going down there I love the different scent and So why do they make this so hard? So we have to go walk over this or not. We have to ah climb over. It's a lot of work, more than we should have to do. I mean, there's a route there after all. <laughs> all right, so that's Sentan doubled up, that direction, like they had over there. All right, they see they need help. I don't know why when they cut that out. All right, but they never have people on so. As Angela would have said, hey, you are the idiot go to the traffic chat to them and then I want to engage. Check me one of those looks on purse or lips and look away. Hey Angela. <laughs> Entrance way to walk.
Can you get to the beach that way? Yeah. That way or that way? people eh Love those lobster case cases. Music. You see, ain't it great? And you get people more rafting going up the river. The river. It's gorgeous. See, so again, they go over to the side. So you go over that side, some will go over this side. A lot of them. This one's nicely decorated. Let's see how this. Three of them. Three of them. And they don't hit, eh? Impressive. a whole bunch of people. YouTube channel eh? YouTube channel Yeah, kind of. <laughs> eh. Morning.
is this? Well, I guess you can come further down to Kylie. And there's those nets. Lobster nets. It's all the culture of fishing. I guess it's sometimes water runs through here, so it's a runoff. Look at this building. It's a gorgeous building. Here's my interceptor from Continuous Narrative from let's say Wednesday. How when somebody come? Yeah, there it is. I might have figure off it. You love it. Ah. Hey, oh, you <laughs> That's my um. The reason I did that was because that's my uh, the guy. Skidoo guy, who I interviewed last time. Wait. Oh, the river water is gorgeous. Yeah, I feel like start this up. Oh, they're coming us already. The rafters. They have cool drinks. You have cool stuff too, right? You have cool stuff? Right. I'll come back and get some. Black children. I think we're local. And hello, you know that's the nude beach over there, so. And we take this demo walk nude, you know, on the beach. Can't really see the color of the sun. 
But yeah, me I'm gonna look a show. So it's not even not even pride. But then you would find the beach they walk up and down. So that's what that name cup uh San Susi without care and so never make care. Just a walk or come. Put on your clothes. Oh dear. I don't sound problematic. Listen, I do believe in. Listen, we should all walk around nude. Everywhere people can walk around nude. When I was going to. Remember the first time I experienced that was being in Africa, of all places, actually, Senegal, um, where we went to this resort where, yeah, it was. Well, it's not even that it was optional. It's just that when you go to a lot of French places, people just. Women walk around topless. Not even an issue. Nobody never make here. And me and my partner were like, what? Huh? It's like seeing gay people holding hands when we were in Spain and even as queer people ourselves we were like what like we we're the ones staring and going what the hell are going on when they as regular Spanish people they're day, day, day people just I was like that even never make here San Susi as they would say you see what I'm saying yeah yeah I come all the way up here, so you know. I come close because I think he's an exhibitionist. I mean, he just wants to go to the river and never expect me to have camera pan him. That's wild. All right, turn up there now, like when I say I turn up there. I love this woman's hair. We can't sit properly because the sun is in. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh my God, I did say I want to come here again today. Oh, my teeth smutty. Like he said he does. There we go. My body right now. 